it's not easy to work on a car like that. A car that uh, is so original, a car which is already a sculpture. Can you paint on the sculpture of someone else? Can you paint on a Michelangelo sculpture? There was no reason for me to add something to this car, which is in itself really a work of art. After some discussion, I thought, okay, I'm going to think about it and perhaps find an interesting idea. And this idea was relatively simple. I thought I have to go in the direction of my painting. And also the fact that I always call my work self-referential, I thought that it would be inter interesting to have a subject matter, something on the car, paint about the car itself. But how do you resolve that aesthetically? I started to use the engineering studies and uh, the equations that made this car be uh, the fastest car in the world. I asked them to make some variations on that idea, and they did. And they showed me several photomontages, which were very uh, convincing. We selected one. The one that we selected was the one where the back of the car is monochrome, only one color, very dark brown, extremely dark. And the front would be like uh, if the wind, the speed of the car would erase the text. They showed me the real color on the real shape of the car, just exactly how it was going to be in reality. I got a very good feeling when I saw that. I thought it was very spectacular. At the same time, they proposed to me that we could also do something inside the doors. We were choosing a brownish leather, a little bit like the color of my sculpture. The same equations, the same text, you know, that we have outside. It's really adding something. When you open the doors of the cars, you also have a peace of mind, we can say. Another thing that we did is um, to paint the wheels in uh, two different colors. I thought that it would give some uh, illusion of strength, of power. And that came out very well. Just to remind people about... Um, my work, you know, so they recognize better my, my, my style, let's say. We decided to have the two caps for the oil and the gas, and also inside between the two passengers, between, between the two seats, that sort of a plate, a metal plate, and there will be an indeterminate line. It's just a plus to, to the paint that we did on the car. Everything is at the top, the top. That's why I'm so honored to have done, you know, to have worked on a car like that one, you know.